Good evening and welcome back. Students stunned today after learning in a little more than a year that their schools will no longer exist. And some big changes. Two all girls Catholic high schools, Mother of Mercy and Macaulay, will merge beginning the fall of 2018. Now, Jordan Burgess is live tonight with a look at what's behind this merger. Jordan? Right now, this is the building where that new school will be. It's the current site of Macaulay High School, but even though the building's being used, both Macaulay and Mercy High Schools will be closed. And the Sisters of Mercy say there's one major reason for their move took everybody by surprise. A typical school day that suddenly was anything but. We had some Kleenex breaks at both schools. Students and teachers at Mercy and Macaulay High Schools found out this morning that in a little more than a year, their schools will be closed. In their place, a new school, Mercy Macaulay, will start in the fall of 2018. It will still be about Mercy education and the tradition and the excellence it brings. The Sisters of Mercy, who run the two Catholic girls schools, say declining enrollment, a problem for Catholic schools throughout the country, is why they're making this move. McCauley has gone from about 800 students in 2008 to 468 now. Mercy had 570 in 2008 and is now at 495. We've all been aware that uh, uh, the number of students uh, coming out of Catholic elementary schools has been declining and that that's uh, placed a pressure on enrollment. Sophomores this year will be the first to graduate from the new school, but even those who won't be moving to it, like Mercy senior Hannah Wagner, will have to deal with their alma mater no longer existing. Mercy is my home and it'll be sad to see it go, but I think this new school will be amazing. But all that will be left of their old schools are their reflections. Generations of my family have gone to school here. My own daughter went here. Uh, the building has such charm. Uh, the legacy of the Sisters of Mercy is just built into the place and you can feel it oozing from the walls. Now much still has to be worked out about what shape the new school will take here. A transition committee has been formed to handle that. Parents, students and teachers are all being asked to play a role. And at this point, the Sisters of Mercy also haven't decided what to do yet with the old Mercy High School. Reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 9 on your side.